You are warmly welcomed on SLTV Lab. So guys, I would like us to see how to determine QRS complex amputated on the rim blades. Is that clear? I would like to show you how to calculate QRS complex amputated on the rim blades. Good. What you do, you look at this. Here we have the read one, read two, read three. Then we have AVR, AVR, and AVF. Now, you are going to use the same scale, measurement scale. Let's use like millimeter. You look at this, read one. What do you look at? You look at this R wave. There is no Q wave here, but there is R wave. And there is a little S wave. Now you see, this small square actually, the small square on this electrocardiogram paper, it's one millimeter. Then when you consider this deviation of R wave upward, it is, let us calculate the small squares. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six small squares. Six. We write down six. Good. There is no downward deviation. So, lead one equals to six. Is that clear? Now, let's go to read two. Good. Oh, wow. Lead two, let's calculate. There is five small squares here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, we have within read two, we have how many? Nine. Nine millimeters. So that is for read two. Now let's go to read three. This is read three. One, two, three, four. There are only four. We write down read three. Read three. On read three, we've got four millimeters. Good. Is that clear? Read one is six, read two, nine, read three is four millimeters. Let's go to bipolar limb blades, AVR, AVR, and AVF. So here, what I can tell you, here it is positive. This is positive. It's just plus six. It is positive. Here also is plus nine. I'm saying uh, they are positive because ala wave points upward. So that is why I'm saying they are positive. Even here it is plus four. Now let's go to the augmented limb blades or bipolar, I mean unipolar limb blades. Let's start from AVR. When you see AVR, our wave points downward it's negative so so it's going to be countered into a negative let's count to the small squares that are into millimeters here we have one two three four five six seven we have minus seven for av for a AVR for AVR we have minus seven. Is that clear? So for A V R. So we have minus seven. Good. Let's see 
AVLO. This is good now. Let's see AVLO. We have both negative, I mean both positive and negative. Now, on a positive, we have, let's see, we have one small square and a half of the small square. But downwards, let's make it clear. Okay, good, this is clear now. When you move upward, it is one and a half. When you go down, it's just one small square, which means it's one plus one and a half minus one, which is a half millimeter. Good. That is for AVL. A V L equals. So this is clear now. We have plus one and a half. Now minus one, which equals to zero point five millimeters. Is that clear? This is what we are using now. Good. Now let's go to AVF. AVF now is it is positive for plus three they are seven so avf is plus is positive seven a v f equals two plus seven good so what will happen now when you are going to calculate the heart rate or determine the cardiac deviation geometrically you are going to use this number this amplitude you see for read one we have got plus six for read two we have got plus nine for read three we have got plus four for every other we've got minus seven for every error we have got plus 0 0.5 for i mean for every error that is why we found 0 0.5 millimeters for AVF, we have got plus 7. So in the next tutorial, I will show you now how to determine cardiac axis geometrically using this amplitude of the limb reads. We'll start using the amplitude of unipolar, I mean bipolar limb reads, read 1, read 2, read 3. Then we go to unipolar limb reads. AV error, AV error, and AVF. Thank you for watching the video. I hope it's very helpful. So please don't keep this information just with yourself. Share this information to your colleagues. And see you in another video next time. May God bless you abundantly. Please support this channel by placing like, subscribe, and the bell. This is a huge support for this channel. May God bless you.